in depth comprehensive and crystalline understanding about peace keeping peace making peace building and peace enforcement in international relations we try to understand with examples these basic terminologies first peace keeping means to disengage warring groups parties in armed conflict civil war or chaotic situation cease fire can be described as the example of peace keeping for example in west asia in geographical terms or middle east in geopolitical terms in yemen cease fire or truce between iran backed rebel houthis and saudi arabia supported government in another example ethiopian violent crisis armed conflict in tigray territory in african nations ethiopia's northwestern part now in sudan deadly conflict civil war war with itself peace keeping can be visualized through ceasefire a ceasefire is the example of or visualized example of peacekeeping peacekeeping is the first step initiation towards peace making it may succeed in peace making or fail resulted into intensified chaotic situation armed struggle deadly conflict example cease fire in sudan could pave the way to peace making peace talks now peace making it's a way to resolve conflict through dialogue diplomacy united nations or regional institutions mediation in 21st century globalized interdependent interwoven world order no nation is protected from permeating effects ravaged impacts of chaos instability disorder armed struggle in any way of the world let us take example ukraine russian armed conflict in a sense peace making is a long term peace keeping for example saudi officials visit yemen for peace talks with rebels sparkling hope for lasting peace this is the example from middle east now peace building we can understanding sorry we can understand peace building with unesco's motto building peace in the mind of men and women since war begins in the minds of men it is in the minds of men that the defenses of peace must be constructed for example india's investment in afghanistan's people their capacity building india's investment more than you stole 3 billion in this context our foreign minister on the blessed say sankar's statement india's only investment in afghanistan is on its people will get full value in return first word is peace building peace building it's a one dimension to uproot the roots of conflict chaos anarchy mistrust its second dimension create an optimum environment of peace and tranquility this affirmative dimension 
wish or an effort to initiate process of reconciliation cohesive social order and participative polity in one world democratic way of life for a nation india's investment in afghanistan its people's capacity building more than us told 3 billion creation of new employment opportunities robust infra faster inclusive sustainable economic growth and development cultural interaction and cohesion india's incredible heritage or cultural heritage civilization ethos and constitutional morality india's celebration of diverse kinds of diversity with the reverence for innate unity that unites us as a nation as a civilization transformed the nation india inspiration for inclusivity nation making intuitions not from exclusive background but with cohesive inclusion with human dignity with respect for all cultures promotion for interaction among them so that they can full this they can try india inspiration for inclusivity said this tiny that can be beacon of peace building for entire world from european conflict to african chaos to middle east instability peace enforcement for its understanding we can take example or we can visualize united nations purpose to establish peace and security collectively and security council as united nations executive arm is exemplary example in this context for example on august to 1990 iraq invaded and occupied kuwait forcefully the period between august to and november 29 1990 the council security council adopted 12 resolutions on various aspects of the situation between iraq and kuwait culminating in restoration sorry in resolution 678 678 that resolution specified that if iraq had not fully implemented by 15 january 1991 all of the security council resolutions relating the occupation of kuwait member states cooperating with kuwait's legitimate government were authorized to all means to compel iraq to do so and restore international peace and security in the area on january 16 1991 armed forces of member states cooperating with kuwait's government began at strikes against iraq and enforce peace in that area with the resolution 687 these are the basic terminologies of international relations fundamental to understand assimilate the essence of international relations